In this video, we'll discuss viewing installed hardware and updating device drivers. If you're not sure if a hardware device is installed on your computer, Windows Vista makes it easy to see all installed hardware. If your hardware isn't working correctly, one problem may be that the device drivers aren't updated. Device drivers are software programs that serve as communication conduits between your computer and your hardware device. Vista makes it easy to update device drivers as well. Here's how you can view installed hardware and update a device driver. Click the Start button, and then click Control Panel. Click the Hardware and Sound link. Scroll down to the bottom of the page. Under the Device Manager header, click the View Hardware and Devices link. Then click the Continue button to open the Device Manager window. The devices are listed by category in the Device Manager tree. View devices in a specific category by clicking the plus button to the left of the category name. The devices appear under the category name. You can view the properties of the device by double-clicking the device name. The properties window appears and the general tab displays the device name, type, manufacturer, location, and status of the device. To update the driver, click the driver tab. The driver information appears in the tab including the provider, date, version, and signer. If you want to view details about the driver files, click the driver details button. The details window dialog box appears and shows the name and location of all the driver files. Click the OK button to close the dialog box. You can update the driver by clicking the update driver button. The Update Driver software window appears and asks if you want to search your computer and the Internet for an updated driver or if you want to browse your computer for driver software, which you would do if you downloaded new driver software for your computer from the manufacturer website. When I search automatically for updated driver software, Vista searches online. If there is an updated driver online, Vista will ask you to install it. If the driver software is up to date, the dialog box reports that the driver is up to date and you can close the window by clicking the close button and then clicking the close button in the properties window.